Hi Libra, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your reading. This is a general reading for January 8th through January 14th. I want to thank you for your patience and for your kind consideration, not begging for your video. You guys did great. I didn't get anybody from the sign of Libra who said, oh, please do mine next. So thank you. I appreciate that. Love it. Um, this is for the sign of Libra. January 8th through January 14th. General reading. Love reading will come up next. I will do that one right after this one. General reading. Okay. Ah. I think you guys are taking care of yourselves. Yep, I do. I think this week is about having compassion for yourselves. You know, you guys are really starting over. It's like you're, you're starting a new phase of your life, getting over some heartache. <clears throat> and I know this is... Um, this is a general reading, but I just have to bring that up. It's pretty prominent, all right? You're just deciding to let go of something. Maybe you're just letting go of some grief, okay? Maybe if there was, if there's been some strife in your life recently, if at work you've had to have your guard up or whatever the case is, or even in your home life somewhere, it's where you've, you've had to be on the defensive. It's like right now you're letting your guard down. You're no longer having to be defensive, no longer needing to fight about something. It feels like you guys have, have um, walked away. You've just decided to walk away from this conflict, whatever it is, and bring alignment back to your life. I do feel like you guys, this is a good week. It's a good week for you where you're just, I think that you're blocking out um, something. You're blocking out negativity. That's what it looks like. And, and it looks like the positive is prevailing. Um, it's, there's no confusion here. You guys know what's going on. You, you, you have this clarity about you this week. Um, and it's bringing a lot of balance to your life. You could be receiving, um, uh, some kind of money, some money from some direction. Maybe you're getting a pay raise or you're getting a gift or some of some money, but it looks like this week, uh, financially, it's pretty balanced out, or you could be receiving money from anywhere. Okay. Uh, I do feel like you guys are starting over. There's a fresh start here. I'm starting over that kind of thing because I love myself. It's time for me to love myself to the point where I matter and I see like a renewal, a rebirth. You guys are going through a period of positive change. Congratulations. Um, and it's bringing you gifts, okay, because you're changing. You may still have a little bit of... Um, heartache in this situation, a little bit of angst, indigestion or something like that over these changes, but you're you're just blocking that out. It's like, yeah, it hurts, but I have to move forward. It's you the the worst is over and you're moving up, okay? You're moving towards happiness and you've taken it into your own hands and now it's a time of renewal. Let this, let's clarify this uh, Three of Swords. What is this Three of Swords? True growth. It's like you guys have grown from something, okay? Some loss that you've been through, some kind of suffering has brought you the growth. You Now you've decided that you're going to create your own future. You're going to be confident. You're going to hold your head up high. And that's exactly what it is. It's like, you know what? I'm going to refocus And I'm doing it right now. It's like there's no looking back. I'm on my way. Many of you are charging ahead. It's like I am moving forward and I'm doing it right now. And I'm doing it because I matter. It looks like for, for 
at this week, you guys have decided to put yourselves first. You're deciding to create your own future. You are having a lot of confidence. You're having discipline. You're having courage. You're taking it into your own hands. You are creating a positive, bright future for yourself. And I see that you're very focused on doing that. You've changed your focus from heartache, from negative, from loss, from um, defeat, from... Uh, a rejection or regrets or guilt, you've changed that into I'm moving on. I create my reality. I love myself. I'm out of here. You know, you're moving on. You're starting over. It looks like you're going, you're headed down a new path. You're taking a risk. Even you're jumping into the unknown. It's time for you to, I'm flying. It's time for me to fly. I think the worst is over for you, Libra. I think you're headed in the right direction. I see um, a lot of beauty here. You, you're definitely going through a renewal, a rebirth, and I feel like your beauty is outstanding this week. You are probably glowing and everybody can see it, okay? Everybody can see the positive uh, aura or energy that you are putting out. I think that you are absolutely shining and um, you're headed in the right direction and you are, it's like you're not just headed, you're running. You're running. You are, you are on high, okay? It's like I am headed towards happiness. I'm taking this into my own hands and you're answering your own prayers. The, the, the strength that you have gained from some loss is giving you momentum, okay? I see momentum. You're like, you're not just walking, you're running, you're flying towards happiness. And that is the reason why. Release and surrender. We shower you with blessings of our radiant love. Open your arms and release the challenges that you've held tightly gripped within your hands. Open your hands, arms, and heart to our love and assistance. You guys are releasing the need to fight. I'm not going to fight about this. I'm out of here. I'm moving on. Take your negative bullshit and shove it up your ass. Goodbye. Talk to you later.